Hello, my name is Oren from CompuMatter and today I'll be going over how to get the emoji bar on your Apple computer, whether it be a MacBook Pro, MacBook Air, Mac Pro, or iMac. This should work for all of them. And this is on the current latest version, Sonoma. So without further ado, let's get started. The very first thing you're going to need to do is look up at the very top left of your screen and click on the Apple logo there. So once you get into that menu, you'll see that there's a system settings button. Go ahead and click on that. Now from there, if you scroll all the way to the bottom on the left side there, you'll find eventually the keyboards button. Of course, it's at the bottom of the screen, right above trackpad and right beneath the wallet and Apple Pay buttons. So when you click on keyboard, we'll have a lot of other options to work with here. What I'm interested in is underneath the text input area to the right of input sources, the edit button will come in handy here for what we're trying to do. Go ahead and click on that. And then at the top of this menu, the show input menu and menu bar will keep that button up there at the top right for us at all times. Go ahead and click that and enable it with the blue button slider. When you're done, go ahead and click the done button there at the bottom. So now that we've done that, you can close down the settings here and up there at the top right, we can see this button here. You can click on that and from there, there's the show emojis and symbols. When you click on that, it shows this little quick view of a bunch of different emojis you can go through, but I like to see the full menu by clicking this button there at the top right of this window. When I do that, I get to see the character viewer which gives me a larger rundown of everything, all of the different categories of emojis. But more than that, we also have arrows and math symbols and currency symbols and all sorts of things to utilize here. And you can also add any one of these to a favorites menu by clicking on one of the symbols and then hitting add to favorites. And you can do the same for emojis over here by choosing one and adding to favorites. And then it'll show up in this little menu there at the top left. To actually use these emojis and symbols, the process is to click with your left click, drag, and then release onto a text box or a document that you're working on. So when you do that, you'll see actually that little green plus button when you hover over someplace that you can drop on. You can do the same thing with arrows as well. You can hover and then you can move your cursor so that it goes in the direction and place that you want it to. And then whenever you're done, you're welcome to just close down the character viewer with the red X up there at the top left. And you can always access this menu again with that button up there at the top and then show emojis and symbols to get to the character viewer again. And you'll notice now we have a frequently used area for the ones that I just tested, as well as separation for our favorites if those are different for any reason. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you learned something from this quick tutorial on the emoji bar. If you have any questions on this or if you're on a different operating system of Mac and you need some help figuring out how to get the same process working on that, feel free to leave a comment down below and we'd be happy to help you out with that. Have a great rest of your day. Take care.